Day 14. Arena's analysis of the whale fall shows evidence of toxins from a harmful algal bloom. We have to find Andrea and her family and get bio samples. On a positive note, Andrea's side trip was a success. He found an amazing group of teens who have been nurturing the turtle population back to health. Running out of dive time. Especially if I go home early. Ready to dive. I'm in and okay. This area looks so different at night. I used to love diving in the moonlight. The pod was active in this area as recently as an hour ago. When was the last tracking data for the baby or its mother? Days ago. But they could be with the pod right now and just not making any noise. There you go, first waypoint. They'll load automatically from here on in. I have the Explorer drones patrolling to get as many eyes and ears looking for the pod as possible. Do I need the buoys? No, we'll use the hydrophones on the drones. They don't have the range or fidelity of the buoys, but we need speed. Thanks. Mariah, you know that no chatter rule was just for the vent area, right? I'm sorry? I think he's pointing out that you seem distracted. Sorry. I'm back. Talk to me about something positive, Andre. Were you able to make contact with the teenagers you were telling me about? They've been helping the leatherback turtle population rebound here in the region. They've developed a nest cooling technology to help the baby turtles. They've also built their own tracking drones. Teens with tech. Sounds like you've inspired some citizen scientists, Andre. I found the underweight orca. If you can easily collect a sample, we might as well screen him for toxins and pathogens. Have you decided whether or not you want another dive back at the brine pool? With everything going on, I really hadn't had the chance to look at the schedule, but I would always say yes to that. Right. I don't remember having dolphins in the dive objectives. I added them because of their role in the disease that hit the dolphin population a few years back. Done. Andre, have you picked up any tags from our pod? No, not yet. I'm going to widen the radius for the Explorer drones.
I'm near the waypoint and can hear a humpback singing, but I don't see it. I think I'm losing it. It's gotta be close. I feel like it's singing right in my ear. Try a scan visor. That's totally weird. I see a scan dot, but nothing's there. I think the humpback is invisible. Sorry. I'm afraid I'm the invisible whale. I'm definitely losing it. I thought you just said you're an invisible whale. Well, not me. The humpback song I generated. You're at a playback station. It's pretty small on the boy line, but in the dark you probably can't see the line. Well, it must be pretty authentic. At least enough to convince your drone. Mirai, have you heard back from Ren yet? No. Is Ren okay? Rai, are you there? I'm not sure. Pardon? I meant about Ren. I don't know. We had a fight right before I left the sub. Do you want to call her now? I can patch you through. Seriously? Here? Well, I have to watch your video feed for safety, but I can mute your audio track for privacy. Wow, I've never talked to her while I was diving. No, I'll wait for the sub. Okay, Mariah, you're on. The drone on the outer patrol just picked up several sperm whales on visual. Thanks. No sound alerts at all. They're being awfully quiet. I think I found the pod. Yes, that is them. I don't see the baby, but it's a little dark. Why aren't they moving? They're sleeping. I had no idea. They look alien. Don't mind. I'm just gonna mute my calm while I get the samples. I don't think they can hear us through your visor. I think she is the one that is needing some quiet. Thanks, Serena. Catch you at the sub. Mariah out. I study things that are beyond their wildest imaginations and that I see things that are brand new to science and to people and to humanity every day. I'm at home in these kinds of environments. It's funny, I, I'm more comfortable here than I probably am on the outside. It wasn't just that I was meant to be out on ships. I was supposed to be in the bottom. I was supposed to be in the deep water. I was supposed to be doing those things that nobody had ever done before. It completes who I am. Being a deep sea scientist, it does require sacrifice. I mean, we're away from our families for weeks on end, sometimes months on end. It's a constant struggle because you miss parts of your kid's life. My oldest daughter was about to turn three when the oil spill happened in 2010. I was to see a lot. So between 27 months and 36 months, I was gone probably more than I was there. When I came home after a five week stint in the Gulf, she came running up to me in the airport. She had transitioned from a toddler to a little girl, and the little girl was gone, and there was this other person there, and you don't ever get that back. It was a decision. I was just like, okay, I'm gonna miss transformations, I'm gonna miss really important things. Is it worth it? I had talked to her class about the ocean, and one of her friends said something to her, and she responded, you know, my mommy, she's the ocean doctor. The ocean is sick, and she's trying to make it better. She couldn't even say important. She's like, it's really important. But she understands that it's an important job. Every time before I leave, I say, my most important job on this planet is being your mother. But this is part of me, too. Baby, we 
don't have much time So say exactly what's been on your mind We don't have much choice So go ahead, use your voice Hello, Mirai. It's me. I don't see a sample from either the baby or the mother. Andre said you were going back out to look for them. I know you are still deciding, but I told him you're thinking about leaving the expedition early. As soon as I have results, I'll let you know. Mirai, I think I have a location for the mother and baby. They were spotted just outside the research zone by those teenagers I was telling you about. Now, I don't have much data, but the report doesn't sound positive. I'll let Irina know as well. Hello? Is now a good time? You sound tired. Yeah, I'm a zombie. I have trouble sleeping. Did you say school wasn't working out? Yeah, I'll figure it out. Listen, I'm exhausted. I'll catch you later, okay? Bren, please don't hang up. Bren? Okay. 